So you might be working through ADD Obsession with me or you might be working through something that has somewhat of a Pilates series in it. And I just wanted to take a minute this morning to go over something that can maybe improve the series of lying on the side. And that's a Pilates series, it's taken from Pilates. So um, I wanted to show you a way to make it more aligned and more core engaged so that you can maybe get more out of that part of the workout, whether you're doing them in 80 day obsession or a Pilates workout or something else that you're doing. So a lot of times you'll do these workouts like day two of 80 day obsession or anything else where people are doing this and I want to ask you how that feels in alignment for you. So what's your spine doing right now? Right, your spine is totally curved. And what's your core doing right now? Well, its tendency is not gonna necessarily be to be engaged and lifted. Its tendency is going to be to push downward into the floor and become sort of bikini day at the beach, which just is not as optimal as I would like for it to be. So when I teach my classes, anytime that we do the sideline series, I like to take their head down to their arm. So, very simple adjustment to make. When your head goes down to your arm, you see how my alignment changes? So that I'm straight from my head all the way down to the pubic bone, so that my spine can be aligned and engaged a little bit better. Okay, and then here, this section here, we always want it to be engaged and pulled up and in, but if we're pressing it down into the floor, then look what happens. All of this just sort of falls out into the floor. So what I want to inspire you to do today is to lift the side body out of the floor, and even if you don't have like noticeable, tangible space there, if you would imagine that you could and have that nice straight line, what does that do? It helps engage this whole core here. Now this area, I'm always talking about this area right here. We want to pretend like we just zipped up something that's just that much too tight, one size too tight. So that if we zip that area up, it's gonna be our hammock to hold the rest of our core muscles together. And that's gonna help us get a whole lot more out of our workout. So for example, if we are working through a clam series and we're trying to stay aligned, hip bone over hip bone, shoulder over shoulder, we're not rocking back and forth and we're keeping the core engaged. So you're just going to get that much more out of that workout. Besides the fact that if you are working on core structure, keeping yourself from being injured or recovering from one, doing that is not gonna help you recover at all, right? Doing that, well that's just a day at the beach and look how everything just sort of falls out. So to live by those Pilates principles, we never want them to just fall out of our bodies. We always want to keep them lifted and engaged. Okay, so use that if you are going through a sideline series in your workout and let me know how it goes for you. If you're curious about 80 Day Obsession or other workouts that I'm doing, just send me a message. I'm glad to help guide you through it. And I've made this statement from the time that we knew 80 Day Obsession was going to release. I know that a lot of people follow me for my work in diastasis recti. I do not recommend the 80 Day Obsession for the people that have not gone through the diastasis recti recovery system, at least through module 10 because it's 80 separate workouts and you have to know how to modify your own workouts for your stage of your journey and your development. And just following the modifier as listed on Beachbody is not the specific modifications for that specific injury. You have to know what they are specifically for you. So do the work first and then you can join me later or start with another program and I'm glad to help you choose one that I've already pre-modified for you and let's go through the diastasis recti recovery system along with an approved fitness and nutrition system to get you the results that you want in a very timely manner. I hope that helped you today. Let me know how you're doing on your journey and let's talk soon.